hello hello my friends and welcome back to my channel today's video is a quick video but i wanted to show you i will manage to get two cheryl mayers here um i love her so much but one has kind of no lip liner as you guys could see and the other one has this dark lip liner with that said i'm not so in love with this i feel like she has a mustache and maybe you guys want to redo your shell with that said i wanted to get on camera and show you how i'm going to be removing this lip liner and let's see what happens. I'm a little nervous, but that's okay because there's nothing we cannot fix. Um, look at the amazing difference here. Look, this one has really dark eyebrows and this one has very light eyebrows. Um, it's interesting. I really like the dark eyebrows, but I'm not in love with this lip liner. Um, let's see. I love this lip color, but I don't really care for this pinkish one so let's take it out i'm gonna be using one of those um i don't know what they call them but i got it from amazon so i will link the description below um i use these sometimes on removing makeup so i'm gonna use this with a little bit of acetone um that's a hundred percent acetone and we're gonna be removing it look at look at okay let's see so the micro spoolies did not work i had to use the bigger size um and with this one look you guys it's working perfectly just make sure you stay on the edge I'm going to be speeding up the process. Um, yeah, if you guys have any questions, do leave a comment. Here is the process, you guys, and I am trying to stay on the edge. Um, I'm loving it so far. Um, it looks so neutral and natural, which is exactly what I'm going for. Okay, you guys, so in order for me to make this color, I'm going to be using... Um, this acrylic paint, it's from Hobby Lobby. Um, I'm going to need white, brown, and a little bit of pink, maybe blue. I'm not sure. Um, let's make it. Um, I'm going to use this LOL thing. So first, I'll start with a dot of white. Then, um, a little bit of brown, more brown. Okay, some pink. Yep, that's it. That looks like it's going to be good. That kind of look like it. A dot of blue. There it is. I see it. All right, now to the painting. Let's see. I'm going to use this brush right here. Wish me luck. Here I am speeding up again. Uh, you guys, 
you have to take your time and be patient with this. Um, don't be in a rush because um, it's really hard to mess up. Now, when I painted her lips, I did go a little bit over. Um, here it is. And I am just really happy with the process. Um, I am going to be adding a little bit more pink tone to the lip liner side of it. Um, I will be mixing a little bit more pink and um, yeah, I will add it to the lips. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do so and let me know how I did here. Is it a fail? Is it not a fail? Ooh, loving the color. Okay. Wow, she's so cute. I'm loving it, loving this moment. Okay, um, again, I'm going to let it set. And then once she's done, I'm going to use um, color. Uh, this is like my nail polish. <laughs> um, I'm going to use this top coat on her lips. So it'll be a little shiny. And that's it. She will be done. Okay, so she's dry. And I'm going to be putting, um, I want to say this is a top coat on her. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to leave her to dry, and that's it, my friends. I hope you like how it turned out. I'm living for this. Um, for me, I love this so much more than that liner. I feel like it was so much. And here is a comparison with the other one. Thank you guys for watching and I really hope this helped. Have a nice day.